Hi, I'm Andrea Bomarito with ZSK Machines, and in this video I'd like to show you the speed setup that we have in the T8 controller. In the T8 controller, on the left-hand side, uh, the second button down, if we press that, that is our machine setup. If I hit the I button and then L2, it'll show me machine setup. In the machine setup, we have several options. I'll go ahead and press machine setup. I have speed setup, tool setup, and operating mode setup. I'd like to click speed setup. I have the ability to change the speed setup by needle independent or needle specific. Needle independent, that means all needles will be treated the same and at 100% it is currently 1000 RPM or 1000 stitches per minute. If I don't want the machine to stitch 1000 stitches per minute at the 100%, if I hit the tab key, I can change it to 800 so that at 100% or my 100% speed, it won't stitch more than 800 stitches per minute. I can also do needle specific. If I do needle specific here, it's going to show me that each needle can have its own speed. These settings were in here before when I set it up, but needle one at 100% is going to stitch at 1,000 stitches per minute. At needle two, it's going to stitch at 800 stitches per minute, so on and so forth. So with, this, with changing that, I can type in my speed. Maybe I want this to be 1,000 stitches per minute like I had before, I just type it in. To go to the next needle, I hit the tab key. If I want this needle to stitch 950 stitches per minute, I can do that. Hit the tab key and keep going through my needles and this is all at 100%. Now, the reason I would do this is that if I have a specific thread maybe that I'm working with that needs to slow down or I'm using a uh, specific technique, this will help me uh, control my needles a little bit better. So once I'm happy with it, I can hit confirm and now the needles are specifically designated different speeds in the way that I set it. Down here on the right hand side, we have jogging speed, special speed, and these two options, jogging has to do with this button right here. When I press and hold this button while the machine is, uh, while the machine is stitching, it will jog at 100 stitches per minute. If I need to change that, I just press this button right here. I can change that to a higher number or I can leave it as is. So my jogging speed will now be 200 stitches per minute when I press and hold this button right here. My special speed. We can see that special speed appear whenever we are changing the speeds and I can say, okay, I want my special speed to be 200 stitches per minute or 250 stitches per minute, whatever I would like. And whenever I hit that special button, it will go to that stitches per minute. Once I am finished with my settings, I can hit confirm. If I don't like the settings, I can just go ahead and hit default and it will go back to factory defaults. But if I need to change it again, I can certainly do that right within here. But once I confirm it, those settings will now be saved into my controller. To get out of this screen, I just hit the previous button. Now I'm back to my main machine functions. I can load my designs. I can do whatever else I'd like. 